Hello everyone, today in this video we will fight against the animals character of world around us and we will a little bit continue a previously started topic about speech and freedom and press and media because very often we are bombarded but by such statement like free media, free press, free radio, free TV, free internet. And now let's ask ourselves is it really free? And I will start from the very early beginning with the statement that free media, regardless of their type, are like ideal gas. It's only theoretical term that doesn't exist in reality because reality is a little bit more sophisticated. For instance, the one who pays and we need resources today represented by money because money is a uh, is something <coughs> excuse me we use for change one goods for another and money is uh, the m money is the mean uh, which we use for change and the ones who has money finances this media and there was a nice quotation by one of the Polish uh, contemporary famous Zinger, I would say, part of modern music, Kazik Staszewski, that he stated clearly in one of his songs. Uh, Mesonate uh, gives gold, so Mesonate demands. Yes, and if media, newspaper, radio, internet, TV, whatever, if they want to convey the message to the population, the ones who pay do not like, of course, they won't be able to convey this message because the ones who gives gold also demands demands from them to keep some line or keep some profile and it de <coughs> excuse me it defines the type of information or the type of uh, content we can find on the websites or pages of this media, whatever it is, internet, TV, newspaper, whatever. That's why I, I would like to go to the example from literature <coughs> and history, what's the source of the word Mesonate. The source of the word Mesonate comes from the name of the one of the collaborators of Octavianus Augustus, first princeps, first citizen of the Roman state, remembered as a first Roman emperor, Octavianus Augustus, uh, Mr. Mecenas was his friend, collaborator, he was originally partially Etruscan, <laughs> but okay. After uh, the temple of Janus was closed, civil wars were stopped, and Roman peace, Pax Romana, in, la in Latin, started. Mr. Mesonate had a lot of wealth, goods. He started to uh, extend his patronage, support, financial support, uh, towards many poets, talented artists, including Horace and Virgil. He, and Thanks to his support, they were able <coughs> to create their really great masterpieces of human culture, masterpieces of human literature, like poetry of Horace and an aid by Virgil. And uh, we need to remember that, of course, Virgil is a poetic representatives of the Roman beginnings, beautiful work, but it also glorifies the regime of Augustus, because Mesen Me Mesenate gives gold, Mesenate demands. But then it's always like this to larger or lesser extent, but I don't have problem with that, when thanks to the support of the Mesenate, like Mesenas was supporting Horace and Virgil, great works of the literature, art or science are being produced. 
it's fine with me. But the problem nowadays is in the fact that majority of supported arty artists are scam artists or deviated uh, simply uh, people who follow some ideologies and spread bad and harmful content among the population. That's why against this negative messenade I protest and I advise you to protest either. Because if messenade pays, gives gold, if we uh, keep the terminology I used before, to the people who can create things which are of such a value like an aid or poetry of Mr. Horace, all is fine. And such messenade we should also support. But we should also remember, as I mentioned in the beginning of this video, free media <clears throat> are something like ideal gas. They exist only in theory, in practice, they are never fully free because someone needs to finance them and the ones who gives gold, the one demands. All the best, have a nice day, bye.